We're here today at the Wilkins Road Tested uh, Shop, and we're here with um, my friend Matt Waldrum. He he's here to demo the guitars and kind of put them through their paces, give us some of his his uh, insight and feelings about uh, what he thinks about these guitars. So welcome, Matt. Thank you. Thanks for having me. The model that we've got right now is the uh, Road Tested All Roasted Wood Roasted Alder. Roasted maple with a roasted maple fingerboard with hip shot tuners and look at the flame on the back of this neck. Not a lot, but it's still there. Whatever I put in, whatever it has, the roasted brings out. And then the bridge on this one is a Wilkinson three saddle bridge with each saddle having um, a staggered intonation point so that you can get this bridge in tune if you, if you work at it. The pickups are the Seymour Duncan Classic 50s. They're warm and when you crank into them they will bite as you'll hear uh, when Matt goes through the guitar and he plays. So let's have at it Matt. straight up telly thing going on. question because one yeah. of the features of the roasted wood that I found is that the bodies really vibrate so you can really feel and hear the resonance in yeah. the wood. Is that I, what I you're... did that's one of the first things that struck me is that it's very light and resonant I can feel it as, as you hold it up against yeah, your body you me, feel it's, it. it's nice so it gives you the, more or less a vintage kind of thing mm -hmm. that's what we get feels, out of the old guitars. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's nice it doesn't have that kind of waterlogged you know, just giving yeah. you nothing back feeling. It's, it's, it feels really nice. I like it. Want to go for some drive sounds? Sure. Some mild overdrive. There we go. attack it the more it gives back to you mm -hmm. so l earlier you were playing some kind of bluesy jazzy kind of yeah. things why don't you pull up some of that that stuff sounded really nice the versatility of the guitar is 
kind of one of the things that the roasted wood really offers. Yeah, you get a lot of tones out of it. process exactly is that something you do or do you have a another third party that you source out I buy the wood from uh, a, the place that does the roasting mm -hmm. what the roasting is, is we, they put it in a special oven that uh, extracts all the oxygen out of the oven because if you generate wood heat and oxygen you're gonna burn the wood so they extract all the oxygen, raise the heat up slowly, and it's like baking. So it's like putting a guitar in your broiler oven. It bakes it all the way through. What happens to the wood actually is as, as the wood heats up, the moistures start to evaporate. As the moistures are coming out of the wood, the sugars and, and uh, uh, all the moistures, the wood fibers and everything mixed together, it, there's, it creates kind of a sugary, caramelization process as it's coming out it opens the cells it strengthens the wood as it caramelizes and it reduces the weight and with all those cells open now the wood is is more stable it's lighter and uh it, it's got pockets uh, that that can vibrate mm. this originally i thought was rosewood um but it did, did have a brighter feel to it and he told me that it was maple it made sense but, but it's, it's still got some of the warmth. Of it does. Doesn't. I was going to say that. Yeah. yeah, it's it's not overly bright or harsher by any means. It's really nice, and depending on how you want to play it, you can get that snap, or you can play and get you know, get the warmth out of it. Um, so it's versatile that way. You know, it's just all up to your hands, kind of what you want to do with this. Exactly. It's all what there. you put into it is what you're going to get out. Right. Of. Exactly. Thank you. 